The CW Network is back with another round of renewals, and guess which show is at the top of their priority? Yes, you're right, and now it's confirmed that Riverdale is coming back for Season 7, even though there were speculations that the show was cancelled. Stay with us in the next couple of minutes to find out all the known details by now. Now that you mention it, I don't feel the alcohol at all. The Archie Comics-based American teen drama TV series is one of the favorite shows for millions around the world. Riverdale debuted in 2017, and since then we enjoyed watching six seasons with 108 episodes. The last season premiered on November 16, 2021, and after the season finale, the speculation started spreading around. The question was, will Riverdale be renewed for season 7? Although Riverdale's ratings have been down after season 6, the show has not been cancelled. Instead, CW has renewed the show for season 7, making it one of the few shows to secure renewal this season. The confirmation that was welcomed with applause by every fan came in March this year, and since then Riverdale fans are sleeping tight knowing that their favorite show will be back on the TV screens. Now let's see what happened in the previous season. Since the season started, we saw that things in Riverdale have taken a turn, not for the worse, but definitely for spooky. The show for the first time introduced some supernatural elements, such as an inverse universe called Riverville. We saw how Cheryl and Sabrina teamed together to cast a revenge curse on the entire town. The reason for this was that Cheryl learned that Betty's ancestors, Archie and Jughead, burned her cousin Abigail at the stake, claiming that she was a witch. Things became more supernatural and fantastical than in any season before. Fans saw a devil come to town, Archie has ripped his heart from his chest, and the entire town joined a witch cult. These were some of the most striking events that took place in the previous season. The first five episodes were aired from November 16th to December 14th, and then after going on a months-long hiatus, episode 6 aired on March the 20th. We're now finally back in the right universe. We've left Riverville Universe for now and have returned to the town with Pep. Season 6 will end with the episode Chapter 111, Blue Collar, which is coming on May the 29th. What are your expectations for the Season 6 finale? You know we'd like to read your comments below the video, but before you tell us, please be nice and hit the like and subscribe buttons because a little support is always welcome for everyone. You can press the ring bell button as well in case you want to be the first one notified for every new video. So Archie, Betty, this one's for you. While the CW Network cancelled a handful of shows this season, Riverdale was not one of them as Season 7 is officially happening. The information was confirmed by the showrunner and creator of the show, Roberto Aquari Sacasa, who assured the fans that the show is far from over. One of the great gifts about this season is that we're exploring, yet again, a different genre, and I hope fans respond to it. But there are still so many things to be discovered about these characters, he said, and added that things have only started and there's so much more to come. There is no official date revealed, but we can be sure that it will come earliest in the summer after the Season 6 finale. The sad thing for the fans is the fact that Season 7 might be the last one of Riverdale. Back during Season 4, KJ Appa revealed that the main four leads of the show have signed on for the next three years, which means their contract will end with Season 7. Of course, the CW Network can anytime negotiate with the main cast leads for renewing their contracts. I had a feeling you might be in cahoots with this charlatan. Did he put you up to this whole misguided play? There you go again. There were rumors every year that someone is leaving the Riverdale cast. One of the newest that became true was most recently when Mark Consuelos, who played Veronica's father, Heran Lodge, officially left the show. His departure bought the arrival of Chris O'Shea, who was the newest resident of Riverdale, for Sylvia Pickens. It's safe to say that the main cast will return to reprise their roles since there are not any official announcements made for now. This means that the core four, KJ Appa as Archie Andrews, Camilla Mendes as Veronica Lodge, Lily Reinhardt as Betty Cooper, and Cole Sprouse as Jughead Jones are all supposed to come back. We won't rebel even if Madeline Petch will return as Cheryl Blossom, or Matt Shen Amick as Alex Cooper, and even if Casey Cott returns as Kevin Keller. But first, we should wait for season 6 to end because surprises can happen at any time. How did you know to kill the other Jughead before I even showed you the comics? Bro, I know all the secrets of this universe. As we said, even though the popularity of the show has drastically dropped, we can say that it doesn't mean anything when it's up to Riverdale. After all, this isn't the first time the show has faced such a crisis. Regardless of what happens, the showrunner, Sakasa and his team of writers have always been able to hold a strong ground among the loyal viewers of the series. Most rumors in anticipation of Season 7 are targeted at the question if this will be the last season of the show, Reinhardt, who plays Betty Cooper, 
Fuel the Fire in December 2021, when on Instagram Live, she said that Season 7 will probably be the last one. Aguirre Sakasa, the creator of the show, added, There's still juice in the tank, as far as I'm concerned. As long as the show remains meaningful to people, and people are invested in it, there's gas in the tank. But what you are is an attractive man. At his show's Pallyfest red carpet, Aguirre Sakasa told Ellie Mag that with this group of incredible actors, they can still ride together with fans. I'm here for it. I also feel like we've had an amazing run and told an incredible, eclectic, smorgasbord of stories, so I'm feeling good, he said. However, Aguirre Casa mentioned that the show may be getting closer to the last scene he had in his mind when they started filming the show, but maybe not for sure. And if you're looking for any indicator about when Riverdale may officially come to end, remember Sakasa's words when he one time said that for him Riverdale ends when Archie has a child. So maybe when some girl gets pregnant will be the first clue for the show's ending. We chose to believe that the time for the last scene is still far away, and if the upcoming season goes well or they have a unique idea, they might add some new characters and then, why not, the story goes for another couple of seasons. There was some rumor that more details for the following season will be released in November 2022, but Lily Reinhardt denied that information, saying that the exact release date has yet to be determined. But Betty, this could finally be some good news for us. Again, we should wait for the season 6 finale, so we can only imagine how it'll end and leave us wondering what will be in store for the next season. Aguirre has teased that there are no expectations for this year, since every year they started very disparate storylines and they always try to weave them all together. In the end, one thing is sure, there will still be a supernatural element unless they somehow manage to dispel every trace of it from Riverdale by the end of Season 6. Looking from our side, we're expecting to see a new genre to be explored in Season 7 along with a new and murderous villain that our heroes will have to fight against and try to take him down. We're sure that our core four We'll have some activities that will keep us on the edge of our seats, as they have in the past with most things that have transpired in Riverdale. Ready, I'm getting heavier. On a related note, what do you think of the series so far? What can we expect from Season 7? Which of the characters from Season 6 is knowing to you and you don't prefer to see in the continuation of the show? Let us know in the comment section down below. If you liked the video, like, subscribe and hit the bell icon so you'll never miss our next videos. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time. And though he will not know it in the moment, this collection of comic books and the secrets contained within its pages. <laughs>